Brittany Griner, 6'9", uh, basketball player who's been playing overseas in Russia, what, seven years? Allegedly gets caught with some cartridges of, of hashish oil. She still has not been given access to our consulate. What, what do you think about that? So what we were told, and, and again, this is all sort of passed along through hearsay. Right. But what we were told was to not make a big fuss about it so that they could not use her as a pawn, so to speak, in this situation in war. So right. to, to make it like it's not that important or don't make it where like free Britney and we start this campaign. Right and then it becomes something that they can use. Use this leverage. Right. That's what we were told. Right. And I don't want to say who said that, but it's kind of like what's been spreading throughout the women's basketball world. Right. And I'm, do we know, is that the right thing to do or not? It's heartbreaking, right. I mean, for, for all Thank of us you. to, that's the feelings of it. I mean, you right. want to do more and you think, should we all use our social media platform and, and get behind it right. or not? Like, Nobody really, this is the first time we're in a situation, you don't know what to do. But I mean, we, we you know, I talk with Dawn Staley and, you know, people that I'm close with. I mean, we, we talk about it like daily. Like, I mean, we're just like, dang, what's she doing now? Like, you think they cut off her hair? You think she got a bed long enough for her to fit in? You think she in the room? With, I mean, like, we've had full on conversations about it. Like, I mean, and I'm like, her parents got to be sick. So, I mean, yes, it's thought about and talked about a lot. And the question is, what's the right thing to do about it?